Hi, we are Engineering Brothers and uh, you probably have forgotten this part or this section of our videos but I want to remind you remind this section once again that these videos are for our motivational purpose and I know that motivation is very very important to achieve any sort of bigger dream or any sort of bigger achievement over here we know that to achieve something or to achieve a dream or to achieve the dream career that you intend to follow up always first important lesson is always do believe in yourself if you don't believe your own abilities if you don't believe your own strengths then you did not make it or do not make it to our goals so it is always important to believe in yourself that means repeat your process repeat your process means suppose we have a plan okay always do remember that we have a plan to execute or we have a plan to achieve something okay though we know that that plan is uh, very very fragile and we need to remodel those plans or we need to change those plans to achieve those uh, achieve those final destination or achieve our final career destination but we know that the process is very very important if you don't follow any sort of process if you don't have any sort of targets then you are not aiming towards your dream okay always do remember that believe in yourself is the first process if you don't believe in yourself then you are not been able to make a perfect process or perfect structure or perfect plan to complete any sort of level or to achieve your dream always remember that believing yourself is the first process the first process is believing in yourself okay if you don't believe in yourself then you are not going to make any sort of plans over here the next thing is the confidence the confidence in yourself i have taken this decision or i have constructed this decision so always do remember or do stand up on your confidence or do believe in your confidence or do believe in your own process okay process means we know that life is very very tough and it is always getting tougher okay but if you follow your own belief system then you can solve any sort of problems in your life okay uh, and i know that my advice towards me because i know that uh, i am not perfect perfection is a myth okay so always say to yourself that i am perfect no i am not perfect but i will try my level best to give my best possible way or to control my own emotions control my own controllables to go achieve that sort of level okay i know that the process is very very boring it is very very repetitive okay on any days you should keep on doing 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 until you um, until you do follow this process or if you don't achieve your goals you keep on doing all those things for example i am from the bengali medium background okay so i don't know the english very well and my spoken english was initially very poor and if you admit that your english was very very poor that means you are getting towards the right direction because we have the perfect standard or we need to improve our spoken english abilities okay so first you have to make sure that what is your dream point or what is your uh, achievement or what is your objective first so first 
I have identified that spoken English is my problem and we need to resolve that or we need to solve that okay so I have started the newspaper reading at the age of nearly 19 years okay when I was in my uh, second year of BTEC courses okay so I had started the reading so initially uh, I had plan or I had the plan to thoroughly read those paragraphs or thoroughly read all the paragraphs and I like to understand the words or understand the whole sentences by consulting uh, some dictionaries okay but that actually given me the slow process because uh, say we have got a paragraph the paragraph have nearly 200 sentences but each and every sentences you are aiming to understand all those lines okay so it actually make your whole process very very slow so I had decided on that time that first I was improving or I should improve my reading abilities then I will cover up or I will try to understand the meaning of that whole paragraph okay so that is the best beginning of my career at the age of 19 as I am from the Bengali background uh, Bengali students uh, should know that but that does not mean that that is our flaws okay we do know our language or we don't do know our mother tongues very well okay so the first process is very very important always do remember that you need to understand your mother tongue from your heart if you don't know your mother tongue you are not been able to excel in any other languages we know that English is our official language okay but that is not our mother tongue okay always be remember that you should be strong at your mother tongue okay so I have started my I had started my reading journey at the age of 19 and uh, okay initially I had the understanding of at, uh, at least 50% of that paragraph and I improved 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 and after proper improvement after nearly uh, say uh, the 11 years okay I had realized that meaning of any paragraph is not important the important thing is the pronunciation or how do you pronounce your words or sentences in a more simplest way and if you understand 80% of any type of paragraph that will be effective for you or effective for anyone to understand the exact message of any type of paragraphs or any type of write-off okay so uh, I no longer do think about the meaning of uh, that passage I just clearly uh, reading 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 and after that I have created a healthy reading habit okay so uh, for any usual days my day have started with lot of lot of reading okay so I do follow the Times of India the Telegraph uh, the Sun okay uh, the mirror all these uh, newspapers or gossip magazines are very very important over here okay so I do experiment with my sp uh, spoken English abilities so that is the process okay the process is your objective is to improve any type of your flaws so first step is identify that what will be your best possible method to reach that sort of level I know that the improvement has is never ending you keep on improving 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 and I know that my English is not like any type of foreign uh, students but uh, that is not my problem if I do give you the best possible message so my duty is to 
give my message i am here i am not here to improve my english okay my message is to give my students the best possible message to understand what i am aiming to give them okay so that is the small example over here the improvement of english is never ending and as it is not my mother tongue i know that my english is uh, improving and it keep on improving over here okay so i know that the process is very very important and you have to be patient about your process okay it is not seven day thing seven days thing or one month one month thing it has taken nearly 10 years to come to this sort of level of communication skill that i have intended to give you okay so it it actually takes lot of hard working and uh, there are lot of days are there my pronunciation was very weak because of my bengali background uh, but um, i have no regrets okay i know that if you have the best possible process you can achieve any sort of goals that you are aiming towards your life always do remember that do believe in yourself fast admit that you have to improve this one okay that is not your faults you should improve that thing then do start your processing the process is very very important and be patient with yourself okay in my previous example i have told you that i had followed or i have i am still following i have followed that same repetitive procedure for nearly uh, 10 plus years it actually is going towards 11 years so the improvement is evident and you can see that i am confident in speaking my languages though i am not thinking about my english words or whether uh, i am improving or whether my english words are or english sentences are better or best i am not following that one the message is clear we just need to give you the best possible message and that's it that is it okay so i am here not to improve my english but to communicate with our larger audiences that is why my take or i have chosen the english languages to connect with a uh, different sort of languages because i don't know the any different languages uh, i little bit do know the hindi but still um, i am not uh, good at speaking hindi but i can uh, manage it okay so i have got three languages so the first language is always and always will be my mother tongue which is bengali the second one is our english that is our official communicative language and the third one is hindi okay so india is a vast country we know that so we would like to communicate with our brothers with our sisters okay because uh, in uh, different states they always uh, force you to speak in any languages okay they always uh, say that uh, hindi is the best possible languages because a majority of the states are always following those hindi languages but don't forget your mother tongue because my mother tongue is bengali my first impression or my first outcome is i am always trying to follow my own mother tongue okay i know that uh, to communicate with our friends from the outer states we may have used to the hindi language but that does not mean that i am suppressing my own languages because we know that mother tongue means mother tongue that is our own languages okay so always believe in your own process that is the main thing over here okay so i think i have cleared up your mind and though i know that it may take huge amount of time to achieve any sort of goal but always do believe in your own process 
that is the best message that i want to give to you okay so that's it thank you and goodbye